Hey guys, Robustus back again, and welcome back to a, another Ryan Reviews. In this one, I'm going to be reviewing AirPods Gen 2. Uh, this is the normal charging case, not the wireless charging case. Personally, I felt like the wireless charging case was a waste of money. It's priced, priced like $40 higher, and the only thing cool about it is you can also charge it on a charging pad, which is actually slower, and you have to go buy a separate charger. So there's really no point besides just a cool functionality to have and for that much of a price difference there was no way i was doing it but yeah for a while i actually thought these were kind of stupid you know like i wanted to i'm like i'm gonna get wireless headphones but those the good ones are so expensive that i thought you know what i'll get these anyway they're small they're easy to carry around from what i've heard they were really reliable so yeah just a normal charging case and of course just flick it open Got the magnetic seal that keeps them shut. Little light indicator in the inside. Uh, and when they're charging, it'll show up orange. And all you have to do for your phone is you'll just open this up right by it. It'll show your battery. Um, you can just literally just pop them out. They're magnetic. Labeled right and left. Same as the other ones, just basically with a little metal end uh, because that's how they charge them. So if you already use like normal Yeah, and they do fit in, personally, they fit in my ear, like, really well. They don't fall out or anything. Some people will complain about that, but honestly, it depends on your ear shape. Like, if you have, like, big ears or, like, you have odd-shaped, like, inner ears and stuff, it's going to be hard to fit them. So it really just depends how your ear is. If, like, if it's, like, a good shape for, the like, the normal ear pod designs, like, before getting these, if you want to make sure they don't fall out, just test them with the wired ones. They're the same exact design, so if basically those stay in fine, minus, you know, if you accidentally tug the wire, they tend to pull out. But, you know, if like the normal ear pods you put in, running around fine, I don't know why you would have any problem with these. Um, of course, a lot of people are going to be wondering, hey, since normal wireless headphones are so expensive, these are so much cheaper, yeah, the, the price and the design is, like, what people like them for, but do they actually sound good? I would say yes. Apple's already really good with their ear pods, like wired ones. They already have really good sound quality. So these are basically that. Uh, I would argue probably a little bit louder. And, you know, which you got the wireless option, which is what a lot of people love them for. Because I didn't even get them, so I didn't have a wire. Like, that wasn't my problem. My problem was just I have a newer phone that doesn't have a headphone jack. And all my other devices, like my computer and stuff, do. So I'd have to have multiple sets if I wanted to switch between them, like at school or something. So I thought, hey, if I get wireless, don't have to worry. I can connect them to anything. But yeah, that's another great thing is these do work best with iPhones, but you can still hook them up through normal Bluetooth on other devices, like if you have a Samsung or something. So you can still get use out of them, though you won't be able to use like or like program the functionalities because there's double tap on them and you can change what they do. Like you can change it to instantly call, like bring up Siri if you double tap. Uh, you can change it to sit, skip the next track, or you can do it for play and pause. These ones, you know, uh, they're Gen 2. I'm not sure if Gen 1 had it, but they have built-in Hey Siri if you have it activated on your iPhone. So, I mean, I just use Hey Siri voice commands that way. And then I have my left play pause and my right next track. Uh, it works out really well for me. And honestly, they've been really convenient because you can do hands-free calling from them. You can just tell her to play a song from any of your iTunes library. Like, you can just tell her to play it hands-free like say you're like working or so you're doing something so your hands aren't free right you, or like you have dirty hands or whatever case scenario is you can't really get to your phone just tell say like hey siri play this song she'll start playing it which is honestly really nice i thought like okay that's kind of cool but i didn't realize how useful it actually is so yeah even though originally i thought airpods were kind of useless like there was really no point to them i completely changed my opinion after buying and using them they're honestly really great if you want wireless headphones or something and don't have a lot of money, great for that. If you want it so you can use it on all your devices because they have different jacks, great for that. If you want it simply just as like a fashion thing, they don't look bad at all. They're like really compact. People don't notice them too much. They don't look stupid as some other headphones do. But yeah, honestly, I, I, these are highly recommended from me. Um, and I hope you guys are enjoying my recent videos. I've been trying to get my review series back running because it was dormant for literally years, I think. But yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying these videos. I hope you actually, you know, at least look into these if you're somewhat interested, because honestly, they are good. So uh, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you have a great day, and bye.